Oh, oh my goodness, another sleepless night because of evil Eric screaming his baby head off. I mean, we're gonna have to do something about that baby. He's just crazy. Uh, oh my gosh, what am I gonna do today? Oh, oh my phone's ringing. Uh, hello? Hey, uh, Kelly, I really need to talk to you, but I don't know, like, where to meet you. <gasps> Jay, is that you? I haven't heard from you since the day. Yeah, I mean, okay, a lot of stuff has happened, but I, I sort of got into a fight with Donnie, and I don't know if I can be seen with you right now. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh, are you okay? Are you hurt? Uh, I'm, I'm fine. I'm more worried about him, but the fact of the matter is, uh, there's a lot of people, you know, who, who kind of respect him, and he's a powerful guy, and I, I kind of need to be secretive about this. Okay, okay, well, I, I need to come see you. I need to make sure that you're okay. This is all my fault. Where can I come see you? Uh, the purple circus tent in your, uh, town square. Okay, okay. Uh, come quick. Okay, okay, I'm on my way right now, okay? Uh, just stay hidden, and I'll be there in a second. Okay, oh my gosh, this is crazy. I can't believe Jay and Donnie got into a fight. I hope they're both okay, but I need to find out what really happened and how it started and what really went on. This is just getting out of hand. I mean, having that like normal argument in the restaurant was bad enough, but getting physical with each other, that's just crazy. Oh, I really hope that they're okay though. Oh gosh, it's starting to rain. Okay, I better run as quick as I can down to the circus tent. I don't want him to be seen by anyone. I know Donnie has people watching everywhere. I mean, he is a prince of Minecraft. He has every eyes everywhere in every kingdom, especially to look out for me too. Okay, uh, okay, I'm at the fountain. Okay, the circus tent is down this way. I, I hope it's empty and I hope no one's in there with them. Oh my gosh, okay, um. Oh, we're nearly there. Oh my gosh, my hair is soaking. Oh, I'm gonna look like such a mess going to see him. Okay, here we go. Uh, Jay? Jay? Oh, Kelly. Thank goodness. Are you okay? Oh my gosh, you look pretty banged up. No, I'm fine, really. It's just my eye. Oh my gosh, it looks really sore. It looks like a massive black I, eye. Ow. Oh, I'm Ow. sorry. I, don't, I won't touch you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I kind of just... Things went really out of hand, you know? What happened? Where did you even see Donnie? Like, how did you cross paths? Well, I was in his kingdom, and I was sort of buying flowers for you, and he came in and said he was buying fl flowers for you as well, and it just got really heated. I lose my temper real easy. I'm sorry. It's, it's okay. I mean, I don't really blame you, but Donnie did this to you? He punched you like that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh, my... And you think he's coming after you now? Well, I'm, I can't be too sure. I'm pretty scared of the guy, actually. Oh gosh, this is not good. Okay, well, if you are scared, I mean, this doesn't really seem like little Donny, but if you're scared and he's really, really angry, I guess, I guess you could hide out at mine. Um, if that's okay, then sure. Of course you can hide out on mine. He won't even think to look there. He won't want to send guards or send himself in with a weapon into my kingdom. My guards would totally stop him. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, that, that works for me. I mean, won't your dad get mad? Uh, well, yeah, we're not really allowed to have boys in the castle. But you know what? For this one time, we'll make an exception. I mean, it's about your safety. My dad will totally understand. I mean, you've got blood on, blood on your shirt. Oh, oh no, that that's, uh, that's tomato ketchup. Oh, that's okay then. So it's just the black guy. Yeah, I kind of got peckish, so I had a I had a hot dog. That's okay, but come on, let's go up to my castle and we'll get you a bandage and we'll sure. try have a look at that eye. I mean, it looks super sore. We might need to get an ice pack. It looks kind of swollen. Oh, before we like go too much further, um, I do have that for you. <gasps> oh, thank you so much. That's so cute. Hey, I mean, it's the least I can do. I'm really sorry, you know. Yeah, I mean, we really do need to talk about what happened in the restaurant. It all kind of just went really crazy, really quick. You have to know that me and Donnie, we're, we're just friends now. I mean, he, maybe not in his eyes, but we've been broken up for a while and he has his new girlfriend, Sophia. I don't even know why he'd be buying me flowers when he still has a girlfriend. Yeah, I guess, you know, we both can get a little jealous, you know? Yeah, I mean, I understand, but there, I'm nothing to be jealous over. You guys should be friends of anything. I mean, you're both nice guys, and I just don't want to see anyone get hurt or anything to be taken any more seriously than this. Someone could end up in hospital. No, uh, well, I think we're a little bit past that now. Oh, gosh. Well, come on in. Come on in. I have some bandages and stuff up in my room, so we can Whoa. go up there. Oh, have you never been in here before? No, this place is crazy. Yeah, it's pretty big. I mean, it is a castle. 
Well, I mean, yeah, you don't say. Wow. <laughs> Hi, living. <laughs> it is pretty awesome. Well, follow me up this way. I'll bring you to my bedroom and we'll see if we can get this all bandaged up and fixed. And we'll have to talk a little bit more about how we're going to deal with this if we're going to see each other from now on. I mean, me and Donnie run in the same circles. We're friends. He's the prince of Minecraft and I'm a princess. So we're going to have to come up with some little tactics to make sure that you don't lose your temper and start a fight. And I'll have to talk to Donnie as well. Maybe we could all meet up. Well, perhaps. Sorry, I'm, I'm so taken back. This is incredible. Oh, well, this is Brittany, my stepsister's side of the room, so it's all kind of cheerleader-ish, but this is my side, the pink. Oh, yeah, real so nice. Thanks. Okay, let me see what I've got in here. Okay, I've got a bandage and a medical kit, so let me. why don't you just stand really still and let me see if I can fix okay, this okay, up for you. Okay, please, please be gentle. <sighs> okay, okay, well the bandage is on you now, so hopefully that'll help and start making you feel a little better. And there's a medical kit, you can probably bandage that up yourself at some stage, but what are we going to do about the fact that you and Donnie are like, you know, in each other's throats? Well, I mean... We could probably stage a meeting, some neutral ground maybe? Yeah, I mean that's a really good idea. I feel like he should come and you should come and I'll act as the mediator so nothing gets too crazy. You can keep your cool because I know you find it hard to keep your temper in check and I'll have to speak to Donnie about this. I mean violence is never the answer. No, I mean the last two times everything has kind of kicked off within the first few minutes of meeting up so... Maybe, maybe I just need to calm down. Yeah, I know, but I understand why you were so annoyed. I really shouldn't have kind of kept the fact that I had an ex-boyfriend that still is around where I am and where I live and with my friends all the time too. So it's kind of my fault too, and I'm sorry that I put you in that situation. Oh, it's fine. We, we've both made mistakes and, you know, I... I I flew off the handle. It's really my fault. Okay, well, come over. I want you to meet my sister. She will totally have another aspect to look on this. She's really good at giving advice. Her name is Little Curly. I don't think you guys have met yet, actually. Uh, I'm delighted to meet more family members. I mean, this is all moving pretty quickly. <laughs> oh, sorry. I, this is not the way it's meant to be, but if you're going to be staying in this castle and it's going to be a secret from my dad, Little Curly's going to have to help me hide you. So let's see if she's in. Little Curly! Sure. Oh, she's not here. Oh. Goodness. Okay, well, right, I'll have to so... send her a text and let her know that we're here and that we're hiding you. This is crazy, though. So this is our other stepsister side of the room, Luna. She's into crazy dark magic stuff. It's kind of yeah, crazy. Yeah, wow. I mean, that's pretty rad, but mm. yikes. Well, if it was good magic, I'd be totally into it. But she's using it against us, and it's kind of crazy. I Wait, whoa, whoa. She's using it against you, and, and, and she's allowed to live here? I mean, it's not... Our dad is kind of pretty much brainwashed by his new wife, Ramona. So he listens to everything that she says. And she says that the girls are good. And we don't know what to do. Our dad is just acting super strange. Ramona, I don't think I've seen you since it happened. But she had twin babies. So I have little half-brothers now. She's not uh, practicing curses, is she? Uh, I think she is. Uh, it's pretty rough, right? I'm not fond of witches with curses. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Um, that sounds a little bit deep. I, I won't ask anymore. I won't make you feel any, any yeah, more comfortable yeah, well, than you are. Maybe another time. Okay, well, come on. I want you to see my little brothers anyway. They're upstairs, and they're really super cute, except um, one is kind of evil. So one, they got really sick, and they needed a blood transfusion, but me and little Cardi's blood wasn't enough. So we had to go to our evil sisters, evil little Kelly and evil little Cardi, and steal their blood to fix them. Wow, I mean... Yikes, but are they okay? Yeah, they're okay now, except one has kind of got this, like, red bit in his eye, so we think he's turning evil. His name is Evil Eric. Well, it's Evil Eric for now, unless we can cure him of his evilness. And the other That's one is That's pretty presumptuous, but uh, I can dig it. Yeah, and then the other one's called Tiny Toby, but they're in sleep right now, so they're in there, but I don't really want to disturb them. No, no, that'll be the last thing. I mean, they'll draw attention to the fact that I'm here. Yeah, okay, so now we need to figure out where we're going to let you sleep. I mean, the attic, I just had a friend hiding out there i don't think it's the safest um maybe i don't know maybe we could just pull up a sleeping bag in my bedroom i'll put up like a screen so britney can't see she'll just think i bought more clothes and your, we'll your your bedroom yeah i mean it's the safest place you'll be right beside me so if you hear someone coming then you'll be able to tell them you know you could wake me up and i'll be able to hide you 
uh, uh, sure, I, I, I guess. I mean, that, if that's okay with you. I mean, of course. Uh, we, we're friends, uh, and I don't want to see you get hurt. And if there's anyone after you, then I need to stop it because it's all my fault for even starting this relationship based on a lie I never told you about, little Donnie. And that's not your fault, it's mine. So now I'm responsible. Uh, okay, sure. I mean, let's, uh, let's set that up. Okay, okay. Let's go see if I can find a spare sleeping bag. Okay, so I put Jay in the witch's lair. It's way more safe there than having him right in the bedroom. Because Luna doesn't even know about that place. But this is just so crazy. I really don't know what to do. I mean, Jay, he got beaten up, but he knows he has a temper and he apologized for it. I really just need to speak to Donnie. But now I just need to grab lots of food to bring up to them and make sure that he has food for the evening. Okay, there's some cake, some chocolate. I mean, maybe he'd like some ice cream. Okay, there's some strawberry ice cream. Okay, I'll bring this all up to Jay. I mean, look at the flowery he got me. He's so thoughtful. I really think I should give him a chance. Well, guys, what do you think I should do? Jay has come here to hide away from Donnie. I really don't know what to believe or what's going on, but leave a comment in the comment section below on whether I should trust Jay on what he's saying or not. And don't forget to check out Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat for sneaky updates on this storyline. Don't forget to check out everyone else in the Little Club. The link is down below. But until next time, you guys, see you again soon.